Yo, what's going on, guys? Shake and bake back, and yes, today, man, we opening some packs. I'm doing a little bit of a, a mutt morning, just kind of chilling out, playing some mutt. I've been, uh, you know, selling some things, buying some stuff at the market, and yeah, today they've uh, dropped new legend packs and bundles. I gotta get more gameplay. I will say that I haven't been playing mutt actually as much that year. I'm only one and two, but uh, yeah, as you guys can see, uh, legend packs bundles are out, and. Uh, I need to hop some. I need to cop some. They got some new legends. Let's check out the new legends. They got, um, Tory Holt, and I think it's Roy Williams this week. So, uh, pretty nice, and we can buy up to five of these little mini bundles that they have. The mini bundles have three legend packs, and then they have a one topper bundle. I'll probably cop all five if we have enough points, which I think we do. A quick word from our sponsors about Draft. Yes, this is a mobile fantasy app. It's perfect. It's awesome. I absolutely love it. I've been playing it right now, and you guys will see that in a second. We'll see it. We draft against a random opponent. You can play versus your friends. You can even put some money on it. So if you're feeling like, hey, I've got a good team, and you can get some really good teams with this, which is kind of nice. You guys can see you can actually put, I think, up to like $50, and if you win, you win like 90 bucks. Pretty crazy. But you guys, get, we're going to play a quick free draft, just trying to get our feet wet, just trying to get in the waters. I was going to play the homie Kobe, but... He was scared. He was afraid to get in the work. So we decided to hop on, find a random player, and uh, you guys can see that right there. We found a match, and he's going to make his first pick. And we actually got a pretty good team. That was one thing that I really love about this. It's super quick. Like, it took this guy like 30 seconds to make his picks. I got to do my picks super fast, super easy. Some fantasy drafts, they kind of drag on. They take a while. This one, it's on your phone. It's mobile. It's perfect. I actually, like, absolutely love this. It's awesome. So we go ahead with our picks, and we're going to take, of course, Aaron Rodgers with the first pick. You got to pick someone good. Aaron Rodgers, the best quarterback in the league right now, especially in fantasy. Dude can run. He can get outside the pocket. He can make some incredible throws. This is great, and uh, yeah, with our second pick, why not go for Adrian Peterson, an absolute stud at the running back position, but as I said, you can play against friends and stuff like that, and you can even play against me. I'll have a link in the description to play against me. It'll be right at the top, and uh, yeah, you guys can click on that, and if you sign up, you can play right against me, but yeah, make sure to click the link in the description, check out the app, it's Draft, and uh, yeah, it's on the OS, and of course, the Android operating systems for your phone, and yeah. You'll be good to go, and you can get drafting today, and who knows? Maybe you can even win some quick cash. But, uh, yeah, it's a pretty sweet app, man. Let's hop right into it. We have the packs. We'll probably open less and less as the year goes on, just because that's how it goes with Madden, especially as your team gets better. But, of course, I want to try and get these new legends. I have yet to get, like, a legend pull or anything like that. So, uh, let's keep it going. I do like how Roy Williams is the set today, and uh, if we get any of those collectibles, they're going to go for big as we get Terrell Davis. Nice, a collectible for him. That's uh, actually pretty nice. He was going for a good amount. Not really sure what he'll go for today due to the legend packs, like if his price will drop a bunch, but uh, we might be able to get that set done for kind of cheap. Might have to wait till later today to do that, but we get a Dennis Pitta and a Demarius Randall. Not too bad. Uh, that actually car was going for like 10k yesterday. Not sure what it's going for today, but uh, Hakeem Nix as well. I think he was getting a tryout with the Saints, but... I feel like we're bound to get one this year at some point. A hey, Jimmy Smith right there. Not bad. Jimmy Smith goes for a ton. We need a 74 overall gold, though. We need that Ted Larson luck. As we get another Terrell Davis collectible. And I don't think that's the same one. Ooh, baby. We're going to be able to do his set. And a Ladarius Gunter. He goes for a little bit as well. The cornerback right there. Not bad, man. Packs are uh, heating up so far. We're going to be able to do that legend set, which is kind of nice. And uh, we get a legend bad right there. That's why I like these packs, because... Even though you might not get, like, Legends, or you might not get that many Elites, which hopefully we get a couple Elites today. That would be kind of nice. I mean, Elites are going for pretty cheap as we get Elvis Duerville right there! And CJ Mosley! He goes in the set. He's the captain. There we go. Not too bad. He still has some value, and he's a good linebacker. But, hey, let's get it popping, man. A little Ravens pack right here, and uh, the Legends bad as well. So, like, even if we don't get that many players, like, you can still use those badges and the uh, collectibles and stuff because you get 15 of them. You get one in each pack. And yeah, you can all put that stuff towards uh, sets and everything like that. I've already got a few sets almost done, but I need to add I need to add a, uh, a few of these Soul Challenge ones. I need to do John Elway's game, and I need to do, I think, Dermonte Dawson's. We got another Demaris Randall. We have a couple of him, man. I've been selling those, and I'll probably continue to sell my extras. I want to do a giveaway over the next few days. I'll probably do it today or maybe later today. But, yeah, I'll have a separate video on that and how to win and stuff like that as we get... A Legends badge right there. Not too bad. Not too bad. Can we get anything else? Fred Davis. Ah, that's not what I'm looking for. Actually, this Brandon Chef might go for a little bit. Some of those 74, 75 overall cards, especially in this Redskins. If he's in the captain's day, he might go for a tiny bit. Ooh, he has. 
Maybe he goes for a little bit, maybe he doesn't because I've already added him. But uh, Anthony Costanzo too, not too bad. Flipping through in a pack so far. They've been uh, pretty good so far. Legends badges in a bunch of them. I need to get some collectibles. I'm pretty sure if you get it like a Roy Legend, uh, <laughs> Roy Legend. As we get another, man, we got so many of these Randall dudes. But if you get one of the Roy Williams cards, uh, collectibles, I'm pretty sure you could sell that for a bunch, man. Melvin Gordon right there. He might sell for a little bit too because he's, he goes in the sets. He's a rookie, kind of popular. Everybody wants to use him up. I heard he was really good actually too. Kelvin Benjamin as well. Not bad. Not a bad pack. Again, I don't know how much these guys are going for it because the market kind of did have a little crash over the past few days, but maybe it's back up. The elite bundles are still out, whatever the heck they're called. Ultimate bundles. We got, oh, this is looking pretty good. 83, 83, not bad. We got Joyce Peppers and then another Legends badge. Okay, I need to get some collectibles though because Legend badges, they, they go for pretty cheap usually, on uh, especially on these days. How many packs have we burnt through so far? So far, about half of our Legend packs. Okay. I need you to give me one more elite. Give me like a Julio Jones or a nice big receiver. A Calvin Johnson would be epic. But uh, yeah, give me some more of those. And give me some more of those collectibles. I need uh, I need to fill out one of those collections right there. We do get five more collectibles after we got five toppers. And who knows? Maybe we'll get a shot at a player. But I'm not really banking on uh, my luck on that, man. That seems like I've yet to see that so far. But another legend bad. Not too bad. It would be crazy if we get an actual legend out of one of those toppers. And hey, a Jordan Hill, one of the new... Football outsider cards from the past day. 84 overall defensive tackle. Wow, that's a nice card right there. Speed really isn't too great, but he's got a solid tackle. I like that. Uh, 82 is not bad. Finesse moves not too bad. Strength, pursuit. It's an all right tackle. I probably won't use him, but he'll probably sell for a nice bit on the auction block. I can get some coinage right there. Scott Chandler played well. Had a first touchdown of uh, his Patriots career the other night. Patriots played pretty well, but of course... There's that stupid radio gate and all this crap. Man, I, I can't stand all that. Like, I just want to play football. I want to watch football. I don't want to hear about all this crap. I don't want to hear about how salty people are when they lose to the Patriots. Like, just move on. Take your L. And, you know, like, <laughs> that's it. Le Legends badge right there, though. Sam Bradford. Ah, I don't think he goes for a little bit. I got a couple of him. Damn. But uh, he did have the Team of the Week card. I tried that card out. I thought it was pretty bad. Uh, honestly, I was not a huge fan. He, like, threw some picks for me. He got sacked. He fumbled. I was not a huge fan of that card. We're ripping right through these packs today, man. No time wasting. We're going right through these. Jordan Matthews, he could be in for a big year this year with the Eagles. And we get a Gilbert Brown collectible. Yes, man. The one I got last week sold for like 30K. Maybe we can sell this one for 30K as well. Probably not, but who knows? Another DeAndre Hopkins. Those are always good cards. He is, I think, my my favorite goal receiver this year. DeAndre Hopkins is nasty. He is so good. I have been loving DeAndre Hopkins. We get Larry Donnell right there. We get Trey Mason. And we get, we're getting some 75 overall centers. Of course, this isn't Ted Larson. We get the, you know, the gold player who's a center, but he's not, and he's got a Cardinals jersey on too. It looks like Ted Larson. That might even be Ted Larson's picture for all we know. But uh, it's not Ted Larson right there. We do get a Legends badge. But uh, damn, ah. I'm, I, I really would love a Ted Larson because then I'd be able to complete that stupid, uh, what is it? Ah, the stupid Cardinals captain set. I did another one of the captain sets actually for Jerry Hughes, but I actually sold him for like 90k the other day. Not that much, but uh, you know, just trying to, uh, I want to do some of those sets because I mean, I think I could do Mutt Master, but I don't know. Let's see how many packs we got. I feel like we've been burning through. Might only have a, t a couple left. Yeah, wow. Only two legend packs left. We only got one elite player so far. Would be nice if we get another one. Brandon Marshall right there. Not a bad linebacker. He's come onto the scene the last few years. Can we get a Tyler Lockett? Okay. He had 367 return yards. Wow. Tyler Lockett was killing it in the return game. And uh, not a bad card, man. I'm sure this is probably a really good uh, kick return player. But we, uh, we, we upgraded that position. So we don't really need him. We get another Legends badge right there. We've gotten some solid gold cards. He'll go for a little bit. And we've even gotten uh, some of the uh, Demario Randalls, whatever they are. But last Legends pack right here, Rod Streeter. The Raiders actually just picked up Alden Smith yesterday. That'll be an interesting pickup. We got so many Legends badges today. Oh, my goodness. I hope in the last couple packs we get Edelman right there. Not bad. I like Edelman. Having my fantasy squads always. And uh, he's always a good pickup, good player to run with. But now we're going to open up the Legend toppers. We have ran through all the packs. We got one Elite. Not too bad. Not really that great, though, to be honest. As I said, these packs, you're bait. Oh, John Randall collectible. You're basically looking for collectibles and legend badges when you open these. And, uh, it, hey, let's see maybe if we can get a, a legend out of these toppers. The next one, we got four left. We're going to get ourselves a Steve Hutchinson collectible. I already did his set. That That's literally worth nothing to me. We're going to have to sell that. Ah, that's not going to sell for a lot either. Steve Hutchinson again. Is that the same one? Oh, no. 
Another collectible, another topper, no, another Legends badge. And I think this might be the last one. Who do we got for us? It is, and it's a Legends badge. We have so many Legend badges, holy shoot. We do have some bro packs, but I'm gonna save those for another day, man. I wanted to open them last night, but I just never got to. But these Legend packs, I don't know, I'm not usually a huge fan of these. I do, as I said, I like them for the fact that you can get a ton of collectibles. Like, we have so many Legend badges now. Yeah, like, as I've been saying, uh, we've, we've been doing some of these Legend sets, and now we'll probably be able to do Terrell Davis. Like, we only need, what, two more, three more collectibles, and we already have this one. Ooh, wow. Did we pull this one that we already got, or we pulled... I think we pulled one that we already had, because I think we already have another one of these. Damn. All right, we're gonna scoop this one collectible for the Terrell Davis, and I'm gonna buy another one, too, because, uh, yeah, I mean, this is the day to buy it, man. So, basically, we're gonna be able to do this set for basically, like, what, 30k or something like that. And, uh, yeah, I'll have a new running back for the next time. Let's see how much the other collectible is. It's about 30k, 32k, not too bad. So 60k for this legend guy who was going for about 180k last week. Probably be going for cheaper than that, but, uh, he'll probably be going for, what, what probably 170, 180 still, hopefully, maybe. I don't know, but, hey, we have uh, all his collectibles, and I might even have another collectible to sell of him because I thought I pulled two today, and I, I only had one able to put in the set. I already had another one, so... Yeah, 9 out of 10 for him, and we got Elway almost done, 8 out of 9, and uh, yeah, I think we got a Randall collectible as well today, so not too bad. We're uh, slowly doing these sets. These sets are great, man, and they, they even give you like some coins for doing them. Here's another set that we're pretty close to doing as well. We just need a couple collectibles. I think a couple of these were pretty cheap, but the other one looked like it was like 20,000, so I'll probably wait till the price drops on these. This one's only 14k, so we'll cop this one, but we're pretty much out of coins, so yeah. We are uh, not going to be able to do this set right now, but only a couple collectibles away. So by the next time uh, I, I have a video, you guys will see a bunch of new legends on the squad, definitely. I have to do another lineup update. I got to get a gameplay out for you guys tomorrow or even later today, man. But uh, I do want to say thank you for all the support. It's been crazy this year. And uh, yeah, I really do appreciate it. But that is the video. I hope you guys did enjoy as always. And make sure to leave a thumbs up if you guys did enjoy. And uh, yeah, peace out, man.